tends to have constipation. Now let's talk briefly about histamine 2 receptor blockers or H2 blockers, right? Um, to simplify this, we can basically say that these drugs block the release of hydrochloric acid in the stomach in response to gastrin. So overall, what it does is it basically decreases the production of gastric acid from the parietal sauce within the stomach. These drugs are usually used as a treatment for um, duodenal ulcers. It can also be used as a prevention for stress-induced ulcers and maybe an acute GI bleeding. Um, it's usually um, also used as a treatment for GERD or the reflux disease. And it can also be used to relieve symptoms of um, acid indigestion. Now, an easy way to remember H2 blocker drugs is to remember that it usually has the, the suffix endings of uh, tadines. So, uh, the most commonly used drug, uh, H2 blockers includes semitidine, ranitidine, and famotidine. So, what are the side effects or adverse reactions that we need to watch out um, with our patients taking um, H2 blockers? Um, in regards to the gastrointestinal system, the patient can have diarrhea or constipation. Um, the patient can also have um, headaches, um, drowsiness, dizziness, um, the patient can be confused. Um, the patient can also have um, arrhythmias and hypotension, so we need to watch out for that and make sure to monitor our patient's cardiovascular status. And lastly, we need to remind our patients and tell our patients that they need to administer the drug with meals at bedtime to ensure therapeutic levels and also to help with any gastric irritation. To see more videos like this or check out other NCLEX resources that can help you review for your NCLEX exam, please visit allnursingnotes.com. That's allnursingnotes.com or just click the link below.